Welcome, welcome to the Lakers News Today channel. Take the opportunity to leave that like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go to today's news. The Los Angeles Lakers are in a favorable position in their quest for the NBA title and are reaching the conference finals for the first time since their championship in 2020. Based on their current success in the playoffs, it's possible that they may not be planning significant changes during the 2023 offseason. However, some weaknesses may be exposed in the remaining games, which could prompt the team to make adjustments. While we don't know the Lakers' exact priorities for the offseason yet, let's hypothetically consider a scenario where they aim to enhance their box office success. In that case, it would be worth exploring an option like trading Malik Beasley and a future first-round pick to the Indiana Pacers for Buddy Heald. Adding shooters and improving offensive spacing were strategic moves that the Lakers made during the season to salvage their campaign. It has long been evident that LeBron James and Anthony Davis become even more difficult to deal with when they have space to maneuver on the court. However, it's important to note that the Lakers didn't suddenly transform into an elite shooting team. Even after the trades, they only rose to 20th in three-point makes and 15th in three-point percentage. Part of the problem may be related to Malik Beasley's performance, as he hasn't lived up to expectations as a shooter since his arrival. Therefore, a trade involving Beasley and a future first-round pick for former Lakers trade target Buddy Heald makes sense. Heald is known as one of the premier perimeter shooters in the NBA and had an exceptional season, setting a career-high record of 288 three-pointers made with a 42.5% shooting percentage. With Heald alongside James and Davis, he would have the potential to thrive, receiving accurate passes and scoring opportunities in open areas created by his teammates. This could further enhance the effectiveness of the Lakers' offense. However, it's important to emphasize that these are merely speculations and do not necessarily reflect the Lakers' actual plans for the offseason. The NBA trade market is dynamic, and final decisions will depend on various factors, including the team's evaluation of their needs, available opportunities, and other potential trade scenarios. The offseason will be an interesting period to observe the Lakers' moves and how they aim to strengthen their team for greater success in the upcoming season.